item that I would use from here is a button. Now the button, I can call it a linkage button. And this allows me to use it like a normal button. I can put it and say, this is going to link to Google. And say, it's going to go to google.com when someone clicks it. Now the button, I can also change the background color, say black or brown, give it a different text color. You see the accessibility item here is screaming and saying they don't have a good contrast. So I'll change that to black. Or I can give it a, a sort of a gradient to make it look nice. And I'll change this to, ooh, I'll leave that fine. And then I'll change this to white and then give it that feel. So. This works out well and I can now curve it more if I wanted into a peel. If I need to do that, then I can ask the link to always open into a new tab. And you realize this has been automatically put for you. This is a security feature that has come out to help uh, whenever you're opening new links, you don't want people to, to, to do some crazy hacking into your site. So it's always good to have this as part of your attributes in your link. So this is automatically put for you by WordPress. I wish, I just wish they would um, lock it up, but thinking about it, I don't think so. Uh, let them leave it open. Um, and then you have, of course, you can always add a class to the button to have it there. And when you save this button and go to the front and reload, we have our button here. And then when we click it, of course, it opens a, a broken page because we had a typo there, but you can see how it works. It opens a new page and it's there. Now we can decide to align this in the center and it will work just fine uh, in the center. So just reload this here. Of course, now it's in the center. 